In this video, you're gonna see us going to John's Pass. Why? Because we bought a building. It had four residential two and three bedroom condo units in it. I need those units turned over and turned into Air Ben and B. I gotta get over there and see what the hell's going on. Where's my owls at? Push the blame, baby. Push it, I'm waiting. Go ahead and push it. All right, folks, we're at the Four Point Sheridan in Tampa. The only thing we're missing is you. I need you in those seats that night to hang out with me and the gang. Saturday, September 25th, click the link, book your room, hang out with the crew, meet new people, talk about making money. Be there. Tracy, where's he at, that bastard? Oh, I just want to tell these guys something. Where they at? Where's my fucking owls at? I'm going to get them today. Oh, today. I'm talking about it a week ago. You know, what have you been doing? It's been so busy. You know, I see who cares about me. That shit out with a sawzor and fix it. It's coming in through here. You get a ladder and a sawzor, you cut that shit out, you put the good shit in. You know, what the fuck is this all about? Listen, the lady downstairs, I don't understand. We got an empty space and you guys won't give her a lease. I don't understand what the problem is. It's Seminole. One, the lease is done. So what's Been the problem? Been done for a week. What's the problem? She was ready to take it on the first. I understand that. So what's the problem? What's the fucking problem? You give them a lease, they sign the lease, they give you approved. money, and you're done. I need it approved. You know, you guys, I don't stand. Things that I do in minutes take fucking weeks. I don't get it. I don't get it. I just can't get it. She was willing to start that lease on the 1st of September. I know. and I've, The lease has been done before I even get uh, it's done. I don't feel good. You guys really? are making me feel worse. You don't feel good? No, my stomach's a fucking wreck. I'm not eating shit. I don't get it. I don't I don't understand why we didn't give the lady a lease if you approved her downstairs. She wanted to start on the first of September. Mike's here, so blame Mike. He's right in front of me. Go ahead. Push the fucking blame, baby. Push it. I'm waiting. Go ahead and push it. Who are you calling about? What lease? The lady downstairs wants to rent it and you said okay. Okay, and I'm reviewing her lease. Reviewing the lease? These things take minutes to do, and you guys have been sitting on it. Lady was ready to rent it on the 1st of September. Right, yes, sir. Okay. Mike should have got off his ass. You guys take five minutes to go over a fucking lease. You give it to the lady. She fucking signs it, and we all live happily ever after. Everybody's right. too fucking busy. They got time for everything else, but they can't fucking do one little lease on a vacant space. I don't, I don't get it. I can't get it. It doesn't right. digest in my brain. Bye. People gotta complain to me. I wanted to rent your place, but nobody wants to give me a lease. I talked to her, I texted her yesterday. Listen, all your bullshit is bullshit. You give her a fucking lease, she signs it, she moves in, she pays us. That's the way real estate works. What else we got? All right, Ben, to update you on these units here that we took over for the vacancy, we're gonna Airbnb them. So, Air Ben and B. No, Air. Ben and B. Ben and B. All right. What's wrong with me? Ben and B. All right. This is one of the three. You don't want me to say what's wrong with me. I know you have mental issues, but I mean, I'm a man. The reason why I have mental issues is because I'm surrounded by the mentally challenged. What are you gonna do about this? Where is the magician Chuck at? I, the great Chuck. Where is he at? Minor shit. I, you understand. Has Chuck been here to help you in any kind of way? Yeah, he, uh, he put the lock Give him a fucking punch list and tell him to knock that shit out. Yeah, right. This is a 3-2 and we're going to house eight people can sleep into this apartment. Eight is enough. Right. This is the laundry room here. Washer and dryer. Do they work? Yep. We're supplying everything here. We got all the dishes and cups in here. Pots and pans down there. We didn't replace any appliances, right? No, no. You see this table? So what you do is you take this here, you pull that out here, the leaf is hidden in here, you put the leaf in and then your table will extend that much further. This was only 200 and something dollars. Fine, they'll break it. Another two people making it eight, eight people. 
I would spend the money, it ain't gonna be much. I would put some kind of way Separator. to close this and open it. Bifolds. So do huh? One's missing completely. Well, that's what I mean. You wanna do something with it or what? What do you wanna do, wrap it? I don't know. Okay, so Altac's putting all kinds of demands on me. Well, you better meet their demands. I thought this shit was ready to rent. I was gonna rent it tonight. It's a great unit. We just gotta make it rentable. You guys move slow. Yeah, you maybe you're getting too old. You ever think of that? You think about retirement, maybe? You're working inside air conditioning and you're still bitching. I'm not gonna complain on that. I don't know. Things are moving slow. These years, they still don't get it like I got it. When you buy a property and you know all this shit has to be done, you come in like dang busters. I don't like dilly-dallying and here we do a little this, we do a little that. Come in here with a big ass crew and knock it all out. I want this place painted. I want this place cleaned. I want all the shit done that needs to be repaired. I want it done immediately, as soon as you buy the place. You do it, you get it out the way, and you ain't gotta worry about it no more, and you can move on to making money, okay? Because time is money, and they're wasting my time, so they're wasting my money. All right, we gotta hurry up and get these things online. Still need the deluxe Listen, from the hotel. Fine, everything with the locks, how about that? You can get done. Because we're gonna miss the whole snowbirds and reserving stuff for months at a time. Somebody might wanna come in here and rent this place for a month. And we're missing it. I don't know, I have a whole fucking crew in here working to get this shit done. When I worked for Mark Wilton, I would stay up all friggin' night with a bunch of guys, and we didn't stop until the shit was done. There's no excuse. As long as you got your materials, you get the people to do the work, you get it done. I have to get all the monkeys together, and see what's your freaking plan, okay? Who's doing what? When's it gonna get done? That's the problem. I, you know, I shouldn't have to meet with them after all these years, but I still gotta have meetings with them, you know? They try, but they need that push. Sometimes you gotta take a big ass fork and you gotta stick it in their ass. They need that. And if they don't like the way I am, I'm sorry, but I don't like being this way, but they make me this way. You don't want me to go around with a big ass fork? Then do your friggin' job so I don't have to worry about it. It's the same goddamn money you're spending, whether you spread it out and take forever, or get it done right away. You're spending the same money on labor. Problem is, when you spread it out, you're losing money. These units can rent for 300 bucks a night. It's a lot of dough. Bully playing with dolls again? Yeah. Whose bag of dolls is in there, Mike's? Oh, pick a doll. Did you say thank you, Mr. Ben? You're welcome. That's a little heavy, kid. I don't know if you can handle that with, with I was going to give a one. Mike gives an old bag. I might bag. have to carry that for you. Dude, know, I said, would you rather put it on the side? Nobody pushes a, a fucking easier. buck. They push the buck even with chalk. I'm chop. not pushing the buck. He asked me for it. lady's sitting here she wants to rent another place from us to open up another yogurt city in our other shopping center she's waiting for a lease it makes no sense now i gotta go in there and look like a schmuck well i don't feel so bad look how her husband looks candy boba as i was saying i think you're gonna be extremely successful opening up your second location in the Seminole Shopping Plaza. I think 100% correct. You're gonna do like a coffee thing there? That coffee, would really be good. Coffee, gelato, everything. It's gonna be amazing. That's great. It's gonna be a great place. I I'm wish excited. you the best of luck. Thank you. What do you about all your equipment and all that stuff? You got all that lined up and all that good well, stuff? Got it all. I can't push the button until I have that lease. I'm giving you my money without a lease, so, because I trust you. Giving you money without a lease. So. You know, this is the kind of people I like to do business with. Dude, She's doing dude. her part, now you do your part. We're not sure about the chickens yet. You may not be going nowhere. You might be stuck here. 
Oh boy, get ready for this one. Hey, Marlo, what the hell's going on, man? What's going on is that you guys are moving all too slow. That's what's going on. You want to see some <laughs> of my moves, man? The problem is you're too busy and you're making too much money. And you ain't got time for us. Well, I'm in real estate now. We've I was watching this, this guy, Ben. He taught me how to, you know, wheel and deal real estate. I'm fucking making millions. It's amazing. That's great. So I'm trying to fit in these little projects for the guy. You know what I mean? Well, if you're too big guy. now, we can go to somebody no, else. We're not too big for you. You know, brother. we call we a painter up best. right now. Get him over here. I got my lift guy here. We're getting a lift over here. Get a lift. Lift yeah. yourself up, too. <laughs> Already, man. That's shit. Bentley, you know what's going on? You're too busy. That's not a Bentley. That shows he's an Italian mama Luke. Like it's a Rolls like Royce. Drove, this guy's only drove Lincolns and Cadillacs his whole life. One day he almost found himself in the trunk of one. And here's his son who's getting old now. He's starting to look like his brother instead of his son. Hey. <laughs> nice of you to dress up today. At least you know what kind of work he does. Puts the clothes on in the morning looking like that because it makes him look like he's actually working. I ain't never seen a kid do shit, you know? It's that red, man. It's hey, freaking beanie bird. shit. We're gonna do it while you have to lift here. We're gonna you gotta do that shit. Like, Little Ben know. just fell down in Orlando. Are you serious? What did he do? I don't know. He's clumsy. Look at that bridge. Beautiful. Fucking holding up like Good. This. Why don't you jump off you it? Paint in the garage right there. <laughs> yeah, when are we gonna go back on the ropes? We like the ropes. I'd like to give you a rope, all right? Ben, what do you think? Right here. here. What about the window frames? So I'm uh, colorblind. Oh, you're colorblind? You pick the colors. Do the same color you do your nails on the weekend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, the question is, why are we so successful here and the previous owner wasn't? You know why? Because we put our love into it and our sweat and our money. Don't buy no goddamn real estate unless you plan on Work in it. If it needs paint, paint it. If it needs landscaping, landscape it. Fix it up. Pump the dump. And then it won't be a dump no more. Chuck can't see that and touch it up. You can't find a quarter paint and touch it up. Man, I keep them on the low end. This is everyday minor shit that sticks out. It don't cost nothing to do that. Uh, it right. costs nothing. Five minutes, ten minutes. I use him for mechanical shit. We're not shit, taking not care painting. of this place like we should. It's a tourist attraction. It's not, not like a, a hobo building, you know? No, it's not a hobo building. All right. <laughs> so that's it. We came here. We're on top of our asset. This is what you call asset managing. Problem is, I'm dealing with a bunch of asses. <laughs> and that's the story. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Hey, we only got about a week left, okay? We still got rooms. Come on, I'm gonna be there Saturday night. Tampa's a great town to check out too. Come hang out with me and the whole gang this Saturday. I want those rooms booked. I need the money. You know I follow you. Hey, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. No problem. Thank you. Follow him. You follow him, you're a smart lady.